have been monitoring the activities, we decided to surprise the Bayasa government on impounded cows. According to a recent development report reaching us, the Bayasa state government had today impounded 34 cows from herdsmen who flaunted the law on open grazing ban in the state by the governor. Following through the information, Chestman obtained from the Punch newspaper, it was gathered that these S men have been flaunting the order by the state governor for some time now as they tend to secretly graze their cattle in the bush at night. Narrating further, the Commissioner of Agriculture in the state, Mr. David, disclosed that these herders normally transport their cattle to different locations in the state at midnight, which seems to be convenient time for them to carry out their activities. Mr. David also stressed that the state has been monitoring the activities of these herders for some time without them being aware of it before they decided to surprise them by impounding 34 cows, which could only be released after a fine must have been paid, the commissioner added. If all southern states start to deal with the criminal without fear, they will return to the desert. They came from Nigerians are reacting. Good morning, Governor. I greet you special. Don't mind those stupid people, fearful, fearful animals like cow, he is. He will catch them. Very excellent development. Thank you. A month ago, we traveled to Ekboma in Edo State. We saw his men with cows. Last week, we went to Bini, Edo State. We saw his men with cows. Obasike is exposing his people to attack. You are an idiot for misunderstanding the president and misinforming the gullible points of corrections. Buari did not say Southeast is a dot in circle. Rather, Buari said those causing trouble in Southeast and dots in circle. Mumu people continue in the circle. <laughs> I don't know where this one is coming from. Let me just drop that. Okay, someone said here, yeah, Buhari is referring, honestly, these have gone to something. People just jump to another, you know, and start attacking themselves here. Yeah, we are talking about Bayasa State. Someone is saying here, yeah, can David Omai of Ebony State copy this? Can Uzadima of Imo State take a clue from this? Can the useless Enugu governor, who always cry like a baby anytime Fulani Esmen massacre his people, take this very step? Shameless governors. Lovely move, Mr. Governor. Thanks for doing that. That's the way to set example to the rest. Due process, investigate privately, gather enough evidence, then execute. Base all cadet intelligence. Well done, my man. Forget about payment of fine job. When the law was passed, was there anything as fine attached? Deal with them completely and let the idiots have the land. Otherwise, leave the run, uh, land, sorry. Otherwise, they might choose payment of fine as an option. This news sweets me well, well, not be small. Somebody just said that. How oh, this governor, I like you, is an active governor. This is what we are expecting others to do. That is the only way to stop these useless people from there, walking from here, there, and there, everywhere, killing people, raping people, smother, and all that. This indeed is the language they understand. Better cheers. Keep, keep it up, good work. Deal with them. I support you. All right, someone said, Your Excellency, everybody is now aware that XX and um, Isab have arrived in the South. So those who are doubting before can now see the truth. One Usma Umar Sokoto wrote a letter passed across the internet that they will not stop the agenda until they drop Quran into the uh, 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 Tantanic Ocean. Mobilize your votes and the people to defend your, your, your land. All right, bring them to book and remind, remind them 
that they can be prisoned. Let them go and release their cattle for them because collecting money from them is very dangerous. Release? Fine? No. It's free. Hmm? Come, come to think of it. If you do that, that means the, all the effort has been, it's just waste. You don't do that. They don't even supposed to get those cow back. Let them know that these people are serious. It's not that. They, they will just talk without backing it with actions. And that is the reason why these people keep on doing all what they are doing. If we keep them quiet, they will keep on misbehaving. Someone just dropped that. The issue of pain fan is irrelevant. A war is already on. Use the cows as, as spoons. Please slaughter the cows, share the meat, but don't forget me. I will be pleased to have some, at least, for a pot of pepper soup. Have they not killed and destroyed our farms enough? So guys, you've all heard it now. These are so many reactions from Nigerians. Some are of the view that it's a good job anyway for them to at least impound these cows. But for them to come and pay fine, say make not, may they not try that. Say because if they try that method, some people will prefer to be paying the fine and they will not go and they will not do anything possible to make sure that they stop this open grazing because this open grazing they make them they go they rape people wives people smothers children and all that killing farmers destroying crops but if they are not moving around the this insecurity of a thing that's being witnessed all over can be curtailed you know, these are the suggestions Nigerians are giving that they should forget about paying fine. Since you don't, you don't miss them, they say you don't miss them. You get anything when you see for the matter, say make you manage them. So guys, you've all heard it now. I'm dropping it here for now. It's the comment section. What do you